Hey guys, it's Bear now. Welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Blind. In the last part, we took a boat ride to the city of Beach. And this part, we are heading west. We we didn't follow the rule and we headed east first, but now we're actually gonna head west. Dang it, there's enemies. So anyway, so we Silver wheel! Oh! Yeah! Um, so anyway, so I don't exactly know, like, what just happened. There's an egg. Oh, no! <laughs> no! What is this? Grangland. Oh, this is 550L. And yet it does more damage. This thing has to have less health, right? Oh, shoot you, boy. Maybe I should put... Oh, it's a junior, okay. Uh, well, I'm gonna fire this one. Ah. So anyway, so... Uh, I know it's Wednesday the... What, what would it be? It's 23rd? I know my calendar. Wednesday 23rd. Ha I hope you guys had a great Easter. Oh, okay, I guess killing the big one kills all of them, so I guess attacking with melee they can switch to magic. Also, I didn't- Oh, sweet, fire level up. That's kinda cool. Um... Uh, I- So yeah, so... I'm recording this on the Saturday, so I haven't actually eaten any, like, bajillion tons of chocolate so far. But I can tell you that I probably will. Probably. Uh, it's also Anzac Day on... On, uh... What would be Friday, I guess? 25th of August, yeah. So, oh my gosh, more egg! What an excellent enemy! Yeah, crits! Uh, let's see, can I seal the evil in them? Fire to- whoa, look at that MP needed! And it doesn't hit all of them. Whoop! That's a bit of an experiment. Also, that just muted them. I thought seal evil got rid of, um, their MP. I didn't realize that it was actually a mute. Uh, so, that did a lot of damage, by the way. I was about to say, wow, I got so much experience from that battle, and then I realized, yeah. So anyway, so we are heading west. Um, we finally get, like, a lot of battles, jeez. I, I, um, recently was just watching, uh, Chucky Conroy's first Let's Play of, um, Earthbound, and I was just like, wow. Now that I think about it, there really wasn't a lot of fighting in Earthbound. I don't know how effective Bio is, I'm not gonna use Fire. Fire too, unless the, unless the situation actually really needs to. Also, does this guy just spew the other egg out when he hits a certain damage level? Because, like, it clearly isn't his turn until Barrett attacks. But yeah, he does that. So now Barrett's having has to hit the guy up front. Of course, I could pull the summon, but we'll pass that. Wait, he's not dead yet. Actually, I want to. I want to see what I can steal from the eggs. Steal. Nothing to steal. Eh. They're not that strong. They're just. I see the new the nuisance of them because you can't just melee them. You have to take them out using magic, basically, or you're gonna be in a hard time. At least you can take them out with melee, unlike that boss. That boss. Literally, I relied on limit breaks. Have I headed west enough? Jump! Oh, I saw someone. Hello, good sir! Whew! Hey, you're actually talking to me! What is it? I just passed a guy in a black cape back there. I just tried to tell him that it's dangerous up ahead and he ignored me. Sephiroth! 
There was a black cape guy here too? Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. It's the fun of being on the road. Oh! Is this a boss or is it just an enemy that's on the road? Three different enemies that are on the road. Uh, Baron, what kind of magic you got? You got bio. I keep thinking bio is in the biography of the enemy. Uh, Aresthesia sent some big dinosaur man. I'm guessing this guy with the mouth. He, yeah, I was thinking he wasn't gonna stand much of a chance. The Bagnadra. The Bagnadrana. Weak against cold. Oh, sweet. The the kiss! That's a song, right? Or a band. Uh, Barrett can limit break. So he's gonna big shot that dude. Uh, Eris. If you can sense the bird, okay, no, you don't get to sense the bird, you just get to sense this guy again. I don't really need to... Oh, I can't summon anymore. Huh. Has the up. Zero damage. Glad you're awesome. Uh, it had the, the summon thing, but it didn't have a, um... It was grayed out. So I'm wondering what was going on there. I'm guessing that wasn't a boss, it was just... Thing. All right, gotta keep going. We'll just keep going over the hill. Oh no, we're in Midgar. Huh? You think I would have seen this on the way in? All right, so it's just two of these guys. Uh, boys on breath. Uh, Bio does actually has a lot of MP and. It's kind of interesting, because I've never seen Bio actually do a lot of damage. I've seen it do considerable now. 30 is pretty, pretty considerable. Yeah, do that spin. This is just how you combo them, basically. Now, I'm a little bit worried, because Cloud has, like, not much MP left, and... I'm actually going to go into my inventory and see if I've got something or a couple of MP. Wow, Eris, you just tanking that. You are just tanking that. I was about to say, I probably got like a honey pot, but it was just like, this ain't Paper Mario. Silly. Uh, item, let's see. Potion? No. Nope. When you. When you want a chocobo! <laughs> uh, what else can I use? God Source raises vitality. Raise? The Baron, I guess. There you go, Ether. Oh, I got tons of those, yeah. Uh, I'll give one to Eris, because you never know. Let's see, I bet you I'm gonna get another encounter on just before I get there. Oh, what's the odds? <laughs> Any new enemies? Uh, I haven't seen them before. I don't feel lazy, so. Whoa! Why they didn't take any items. I got more than 137 health. Also, you can't steal anything from it. Uh, oh, for a second I was just like, what the heck was it doing? Weak against wind. What's with the enemy and being weak against whatever it's using? Seems like a decently powerful attack. Punch him in the face! Punch that fish! That fish is floating! Uh, I don't have any wind, actually. That's one thing I noticed. They, they were selling that in the, um, at the beach place, I think. Along with restore and healing. Oh, sorry, I'm um, revive and healing, and I'm just like, dude, revive would be awesome. I guess you could just buy some Phoenix Downs. They're not too expensive. It's not like Pokemon, except Pokemon there is no way to revive someone except for the revive. And they don't sell those until like halfway through the game. It's really interesting playing a lot of different, but very similar games. Just because you start to note these weird, like, these weird design choices that they've got. Alright, I'm gonna guess I'm gonna take that bridge out. Um, but yeah, like, I recently got back into playing Dragon Quest IX. I never beat it, and I was just like, you know, 
I should probably just like play through it just before all the DS game servers close down next month. Because they're closing down on the 20th and I'm just like, ah. Because that means that for stuff like Dragon Quest 9, you can't download any of the free quests that you get. For all of the Professor Layden games, you cannot download any of the bonus puzzles that they made. And they made tons of bonus puzzles. All of which you cannot access unless if they release the thing... Unless if they like do a re-release of the game on like 3DS and it's just like, Oh look at this, fully remastered. It has all the puzzles, like four games in one. Yeah. Wow, we're getting a lot of level ups. I might need to switch out of Red 13 if it's gonna take some time. Unless if we're in the next town already, in which case, okay. No, I guess we're not, because I don't think there's a lot of battling in towns. Oh, chickens! Uh, sent some. That, that one actually took a ton of damage. Cockatollus. 420. Wow. I'm surprised it's not telling us to blaze him. By the way, can someone explain to me what 420 blaze it is? I seriously don't know. Everyone, everyone at school is saying it, and I'm just like, Yeah! 420! Yeah! I have no clue what everyone is referring to. It was like when, uh, 69 used to be the old joke, and I'm just like, why is that funny? You were literally referring to a position. Also, do I just exit, or? What's with this ledge up here? Huh. I, I honestly have no clue where I'm going. Um, what else? I remember talking a few episodes ago about, um, about, uh, um, the new games coming out, and I didn't realize, um, well, first of all, like, a lot of the stuff that I was saying was gonna come out, like, Infamous Second Son, I remember Titan 4 actually came out a bit before, and, yeah, I don't really know, like, what's that interesting about those games. I guess it's a game where you do it with lightning and you get binary choice options all the time. I'm not a big fan of games with binary choice options. I played Mass Effect and I just kind of was just like, eh. Seriously, you know what it should have done? It should have not told you what was going to give you good points and what was going to give you bad points. Seriously, games should not do that. Because that's like saying like, oh, okay, sure. If you're going for a strict playthrough of where you're going to do certain things, you may as well just be looking at a guide to, t to tell you what exactly to do. Like, the point of the game is that it should be your own experience. Like, I was playing, um, also Ice. Ice just went out? Oh my gosh, Cloud, all your material. All of your material, now you just need to level up Lightning, which is actually very, very soon. Look at that, 58. Uh, what else? Shiva takes forever. Elemental. Oh, crap. I'm gonna... Hold on, not equip. Uh, I'm gonna go to Barret. I'm gonna give him the Ifrit. And then I'm gonna go to Eris and I'll give her lightning because she needs a little bit of an offensive kind of thing. Also, I seriously want to know what happens when you level up the Chocobo Lu. He's got sense and that's gonna take forever to level up, but that's only got one level. So, yeah, I'm, I'm intrigued. Like, what does some of this material actually do? Okay. I just realized I haven't been timing. I forgot to time the length of this part. I'm gonna say I'm about like 15 minutes in. So if I get to the next town, then that'll be good for a part. Whoa, what are these things? They look like dumplings with hair. Very red dumplings. Bomb! 
Okay. I get. Oh, oh, okay. They're definitely not dumplings. Oh! That does not look good. Quick, put it out. Uh, actually, yeah, Eris. You could... Oh, wait, your vault doesn't hit all the enemies? Okay, Barra, just take it out in like one fell swoop. If this thing just blows up when I kill it. Okay, good. I'm guessing that thing is gonna blow up the more times I hit it, so I need to do more concentrated. Or not concentrated, if I have larger hits. Like that. Barrett, your text box is larger. Bomb plot, yep, that, okay, I blew. I, I, I just said I blew it. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Limit break, yeah! It's, they're not too bad. That's that's just a nuisance that they'll do that much damage in like one go. Also, that's not an exit. So does the exit just continue along the bridge? Why? Why'd they shape it like that? Uh, Eris, you can just heal. Come on. Take out the bird. Uh, the camera just went up its butt. So yeah, so, if there's any exciting games that are coming out, uh, you guys tell me. Um, I'm actually kind of excited for the new Wolfenstein game, although it looks a bit mon shootery to me. I'm a little bit worried. But I guess, I guess, like, sure, it, it can't be too bad. It's id. And by it's id, I mean it's not actually by id, it is by someone else. But like, but like visually it looks good. Stylistically, I like the setting. I always appreciate that they're saying that it will be difficult. They're making easy mode like a generally nonchalant mode and normal a pretty challenging mode. Seriously, how many games have you played where normal is more so like the cinematic approach Easy is the, I'm a noob and can't do a thing, and hard is, I want to actually play something that will challenge me a little bit. I remember playing Doom and it's just like the second difficulty level was like that. And then you had two more on top- oh, that's a save point. Okay, well... I would like to- you know what, actually, I'm gonna keep going. I will keep going. Just for now. You guys are lucky. Because I want to know. There's probably a boss coming up. Also, I hate roller coasters. What? What is going on? What just what just happened? I I'm I'm sorry. What? I what? I just went to full motion video land, and suddenly I missed out on treasure. It says press the OK button to jump, and then it says get the treasure by holding the left or right while repeatedly pressing OK. Okay, so OK is X, right? But it wants me to climb up? He wants me to climb up, and it's not gonna let me press left or right. I'm pressing OK, I'm pretty sure that's my X button. And now all of a sudden there's a bat. I don't know what just happened. More so, the back deck from a single bird. The bird didn't even bother attacking! What? Why he's just, just sitting there? He's just sitting there. He had the point. He had the back attack. He didn't even bother doing it. I'm not even gonna use any magic on him. I'm just gonna beat him up. Yeah. It's 
Why are there four tracks on a roller coaster? It's, it's not a roller coaster, it's probably like a train track. W machine gun. Okay. Uh, equip it on Barrett, because I'm guessing that's what Barrett would do. Uh, well, the percentage is nice. I like it, actually. I think that's nice. Ah! Uh, this is a moment where I'd like to say I don't care. Also, I'd love to know. Oh, that's what it uses MP. Oh, maybe that's where all my MP went. I can't select anything. Cannot select. I was a little bit lazy. So that uses like a bunch of MP. Okay. See, that's why I was thinking maybe I shouldn't give it to Eris because she's not as good offensively with magic. And I was thinking like maybe maybe it might need something else. That's good that I just noticed I use this MP. I didn't realize that. There is a green. I press OK, so I don't know what that is. Oh. I get it. Okay, so you're supposed to do it during that falling part. You Wizard stuff. Oh. Transform material. Oh my gosh. Tons of stuff. Okay, so a wizard stuff. Let's see what. Eris. Oh, it does more damage. It's always a plus. Uh, star pendant. And all the stuff. But I just gotta transform, which. Could be useful. I'm gonna give that to Barrett actually. Actually, Barrett doesn't have a. You know, let's see. He can steal, he can all. I don't think Barrett needs all because none of his attacks really, really are supportive. Oh no, not this again. Okay, so now I can just do everything, I guess. Oh my gosh, so you all use 22. Magic. That's ridiculous. Uh, yes, you can bolt him. Actually, I'll, I want to see Barrett's effort. Except it's a front lining. Doesn't hit everything. Ah. Oh. Bolt. Ooh, that, that looks interesting. Whoa. What? <laughs> oh, there goes all his MP. A soft. I'll take the soft. Also, that was a lot of money. Alright. So let's keep going. On treasure. Oh, there's T for Red 13. Cloud, go, Cloud, go! Where am I going? Oh, the text box was part of the transition. That's kind of cool. Bang. Uh, all the limit breaks. <laughs> Killed the dinosaur. So it wasn't the Ice Age. But that did 750 damage. I'm amazed. How much does Eris do with a regular attack? 53, not a lot. It's a bit better than before, I guess. Not by a lot. Also, Barrett can shoot things again. Hooray! Yeah, I was just like, mm, I want something to do. I can't really jump on anything here. Where am I go- oh, in here. Oh, sure it's down there. <laughs> okay, do it. What, was, what is this? Something's moving- oh, the bridge moved. 
Oh, that's what they wanted to do. Red 13 is just still on the run. So... Red 13, you are so slow. So you guys gonna help me get across or no? Oh, I guess... I guess I gotta go back. Go down. The other end. Five of these things? Five? Oh. Oh, I guess with five of them, they're actually gonna do quite a bit of damage. Okay, not as much as I thought, but a bit. Four laser! Okay, that's a lot of damage. What's it called? Four laser. I think they count like about six lines. So I guess, yeah, there's a lot of, um, a lot of laser. Fire! 121. Ooh. Just all of this random stuff. Like, this is the mushroom with, like, four weird mouths. Look at that. This is ridiculous. They fire lasers. Really cannot count. Yeah, Paris just dishing out tons of damage. So, I also want to say, I don't know how long this LP is going to take. I'm actually expecting it to go into like the 80s. Even with these kind of longer parts. Maybe not, maybe not 80s, maybe 70s, but. Still, like, I have no clue how far through the game I am. Mainly because I was expecting a Final Fantasy game where you collected, like, four artifacts of the elements. Or something like that, because, I don't know, that's kind of generic RPG thing. And what came up was more so, like, a very organic kind of experience. Just kind of things happen and things have to come of that. Use the healing wind because I can. On. So yeah. So yeah, I don't really know like how far through the game I am because there's not really anything that feels like I'm making progress. You know, I was playing Dragon Quest and it's just like, oh okay, sure, you do. Like you gotta get like the the figs. You gotta get all the figs. It's like seven of them, and that's your goal basically. I'm like, yeah, okay, sure, that's a goal. Um, watching Chaga play Earthbound. Oh, yeah, 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 you've gotta... Uh, you've gotta get all the eight songs from the sanctuaries. Yeah, I was thinking that I had to go all the way down there. Can I use, like, a repel? Because I don't really want to fight more stuff. Who needs grinding when you've just got, like, all of these enemies? This is a long section of, with enemies. Just, just kind of relatively. I don't think it's too long, but it's just like... There's some kind of... Uh, I'm not going to say it's grungy, it's more like late 80s kind of metal. I think it's not like this. That's not... Also, Barrett's poisoned. His beard isn't. His tattoo isn't. But he is. Um... So yeah, so I want to know, like, is there anything that I have to collect in the game? Like, is there some kind of ultimate goal to mini? I will use that, because it's time to experiment with everything. Oh no! He's doing so much damage! Oh no! Oh, one damage! Oh gosh. Bolt plume. Alright, so are we at the other side? Nope. 
I'm loving these environments, let me tell you that. It's really cool. Okay, good, a single bomb. I can handle a single bomb. Uh, you know, I'll just ice to it and see what happens. Fire wall? Yo, oh gosh! <laughs> I should do a lot more damage than I was expecting. Oh no, and now he blows up. Oh! Whoa! The game's not over if Cloud dies, right? No, 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 Cloud's already... Cloud's died tons of times before. Also because... Oh! What? Oh, I wasn't expecting that! <laughs> okay. Also, Tifa, full... Sorry, sorry, Aeris, full health. Cloud... died. Look at that camera shake, it's so organic. Oh no, not more bombs. No! Can't handle more bombs. Actually, I'm gonna use a mini on him, because I wanna see, like, is he... So, if he's mini, does he do, like, a ton less damage? He's not actually any smaller, is he? No. He's just gonna blow up in my face again, is he? Yep. Oh, is he gonna blow up? Barret. Yeah, he does so much damage. Oh my gosh. I don't know how you take him out efficiently. Also, yeah. I clearly ran so much. Okay, crit. I'm gonna mind blow it. It's all gonna be good. Hey, big shot. There you go. I guess you just need a lot of damage in one go. So what's the point of an ending like that? If you're too weak and you need to train, they they won't give you experience because you know you don't kill them. They just blow up. And another one. Jeez, who puts all these bombs on this bridge? Hundred twelve. Hundred thirty-two. He's getting big. Also, it's fireball does a ton of damage. Look at that, two fifteen. That's ridiculous. And then he blows up on his next turn if he gets if he gets two times larger. But look at that. That almost killed me again. That did five hundred and one damage. That is ridiculous. I would not like to to see him if they're part of the next boss. Oh, thank goodness. I'm at North Corral. Yo, yo. Hey, he's back! Well, who's back? Where? Ah, oh, has Barrett been here before? Oh, jeez. Well, look here, never thought I'd see your face again. Those people over there, they with you? Well, I feel sorry for them hanging around and walking dead sentence like Barrett. You got a lot of nerve coming back here. Look at this place. It's all your fault North Corral turned into a garbage heap. Why don't you say something? Or did you forget what you've done here already? I'm sorry. You ain't even worth the effort. Don't waste your time talking to that techno freak. Huh. Some backstory, eh? You heard him. It's my fault this town was destroyed. Alright. Well, I would like to find a safe point. Get out of the way! The only way we can make we can make ends meet around here now is by collecting junk. Gold saucer! Does this exit the town? No. The town keeps on going. Can I at least exit the town somewhere? Does this exit the town? Okay, good. Okay, so, anyway, so we got to North Corral. Cloud almost died. I think that we did pretty good this part. Actually, Cloud that already died. I think we did alright. So anyway, in the next part, 
stuff will happen. We'll talk to people around Corel, and maybe, just maybe, a little bit of spirit. Probably not, but maybe. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you kids next time. See you kids then.